Hey, Mike here with Pine Ridge Garage, and we are on our way to the Keweenaw. Got a group, five sleds loaded up into the trailer, stopping for fuel here in Newberry, and uh, we're going to head up to the Keweenaw Peninsula. going to be a group of nine of us, so we'll, uh, we're going to go up and have some fun up in the backcountry. See ya. Well, we made it here up in the Keweenaw. We are at Lake Linden. We got an Airbnb here, and uh, it's gonna be pretty nice up here in the Keweenaw. And uh, so, we've got trailers set up here. We got snowmobiles all loaded. We've got them in the garage there, and uh, we are. Settling in, we'll make dinner, and looks like it's going to be a fun, fun spot to be here. All right, it's Thursday morning. Getting the sleds out. Here's my summit. Few, few of them filled up and we're gonna go head to the back country all right we'll get some video as we get going Uh, here we are, up in the key one out, day two. First day of riding, getting the sleds all ready. Got, uh, I don't know, two, three inches of fresh snow last night. So, we had a great uh, first day traveling and hanging with friends uh, last night. We're gonna go find some backcountry and some play up here and the Keweenaw Peninsula. Alright, here's our group. A little photo op here. Up in the Keweenaw. We're up by Phoenix. So, find a little place to play. Wild Man Dave shows what you got. Uh -oh. When the video comes out, the skills go away. Come on, David. Thank <laughs> you. 
guys. Oh boy, I pulled his front end over I think. Alright, finally Dave. Pretty cool that thermometer that they show. It's been here years and years. But uh, Keweenaw County's snowfall since 1957. Talking about the different uh, levels in what year. This is last year. Right there. Pretty cool to get up here and see any time of the year. All right, well, made it to Gay, Michigan. We're here at the famous Gay Bar. Gay Bar in Gay, Michigan. I'm going to go in here and Get some uh, lunch and have a good time. All right. All right, here we go. Go in here and. Where are we sitting? Back here? Yeah, but we can only sit five. Look at there. We have two groups. We're in two groups here. Tell me about your rides so far. It's a good ride. Absolutely. Snow is good. Snow. Every yeah. day is a good ride. It is. Any day is away from work is good. Well, we're here at the gay bar. Check the shirts out you can buy. There we go. Look at all the souvenirs. Well, we made her back. 
And we went to, this Thursday we went to uh, Copper City, to, over to Gay, and then back here to Mud Lake, to our Airbnb. And we went 80, 80 miles today. Had a good time, good snow, although we had one, one air. Hi. How's it going? Not did you have a good day? Did you have a good day today? I did. That's did Dave. You, did Big you Dave. Go to today? I didn't go to well yeah, I did. Okay. I was just checking. Anyways, we had one snowmobile. Okay Eric. <laughs> he uh was having trouble with his, with the snowmobile. It was shifting funny. And we got back here. Right here. I didn't get it videoed. I um, taking it apart. So let me show you. So here's the clutch. We didn't didn't get video taking it apart, but so spring. This here collar was just all wallowed out. But check this helix out. Here's a, this is one of them team Articat team clutches. And uh, I don't know if you can see it, but that's all galled the the collars at some point fell off and uh, galled up this helix. Look at that. So we'll end up getting a new he'll get a new new clutch. Anyways. We made it back at least, but it's the uh, way it goes. Well, we made it back to the house. End of the day here. And what time is it? Six thirty. We got back. So now it's time for one of these. Oh yeah. Four, two, three, four. We'll see. Anyways, we had a great time. Wish you guys were here. Alright, here we are, day two, up in the Keweenaw. And getting ready from their place. Getting sleds ready. And we're going to head out. Get out in the woods and the trails. And we're hoping to make it to Carver Harbor today. Well, here we are in Alouez, I guess they call it. I don't know how they pronounce it, but getting fuel. And uh, working our way up to Copper Harbor. So, temperatures are cool, but hopefully the snow stays good all the way up there. Uh, watch the boys play. Brackway Mountain. Up near Copper Harbor. Very beautiful. Look at there's Lake Superior.
wants to say down there. Bunch of legs. Sorry about the wind. Definitely a place to come in any time of the season. Winter time you can only snowmobile obviously, but when it's summertime, fall, spring, you can drive up here. So from here we're gonna ride down to Copper Harbor, get some lunch. Great destination place. Well, the old Milwaukee pack out is working out great. And this JDS pack out mount that hooks up to the link Con uh, connectors works awesome. Check out that JDS website, and they've got pack out brackets for all sorts of vehicles snowmobiles. UTVs, ATVs, vehicles, all sorts of setup. But yeah, this works out really good. So keeps everything nice and dry and sealed up. Durable. So and like I say it just pulls off. Locks on. Good to go. Remember, check it out. JDS uh, Customs Fabrication or something like that. And uh, set me up really good here. Uh, not a sponsor. It'd be great if they were a sponsor. But we'll uh, always look for sponsors here on Pine Ridge Garage. They're concrete. It's concrete. I bet. It looks like that nasty rock that you see on the side of the hills. Just oh, does it? Oh, it's very inviting, though. Yeah, it sure fits. Head there and find a tree. So yeah, we rode 130 miles, going up to Copper Harbor and back. Good ride. Okay, we made it back here. This is our day two of riding. This is Friday, this is Friday night. Made it back to the Airbnb. And uh, we had a great time. It is time for that. So, have one of these. Oh. Anyways, we went all the way up to Copper Harbor. We uh, went on the Brockway Mountain Pat Road. That was really neat. And uh, as you saw, the, some of those pictures. So up to uh, Copper Harbor, had lunch, and worked our way back on the east side of the peninsula and back to Mud Lake which is where this house is at. So we really had a great time. No snowmobiles breaking down. Did get uh, a little warm today. It was in the 30s. Uh, started out in 20s and then got up and got as high as 36, I guess. So had a good time. Uh, some of the roads here on the east side getting closer to Mud Lake. 
they're definitely getting bare. Uh, they're probably 40% uh, dirt, and so we'd ride in the ditches and up on the banks as much as we could and uh, to avoid it, but we had a good time. So Tomorrow's a new day. We're going to hang out here at the, the house and get some dinner and uh, probably play some cards and hang out with all the, the gang. Check this group of uh, snowmobilers out here. So Boland Huskies. Those are cool. A group of them. The red one someone painted, but yeah, check them out. 444 must be the size of the motor. Pretty cool. More of them over there. Check them out. Very cool. He's out having fun. Here it is Sunday and we are uh, all loaded up, got the snowmobiles all loaded up, 
and we are getting ready to head back from this weekend of snowmobiling up in the Keweenaw. We're on Mud Lake near Lake Linden. Good riding, really had a good time. We uh, super enjoyed it up there. The Airbnb was a good place, and so everybody had a good time. Anyways, I'm gonna wrap this up. So if you like this video, please hit that subscribe button. That helps the channel out, we appreciate that. But sure, having fun out getting uh, some snow billing in this year. And just doing some little different things here at Pine Ridge Garage. Next week we'll be back in the shop doing some things. So hit that like button, leave some comments down below. Let me know if you've been up in the key one all riding and uh, where whereabouts you've all gone. Uh, a lot of fun. The UP's got so many things, a lot of history, but a lot of, a lot of nice areas to see and go. So leave some comments again. Appreciate that. Subscribe. And remember, have fun while you're getting it done. See ya.